we are for our first ladies bout of the night. Savannah is an English fighter, but born and raised in the Pearl of Africa. You should call her Ugandan. She is Ugandan, a uh, Muay kickboxer, Fighter, who are you ready? is facing Lillian Fighter, the Cobra, a Ugandan as Fight. well. Taekwondo is her background and kickboxing. What do they have to offer? Oh well, they have a lot to offer. It seems they're not wasting any time. Good early exchange from both fighters. We do have it for us. Oh, that's a powerful. That was a powerful body kick that got Savannah down. Savannah did well to recover. They are aggressive straight from the start. Very aggressive. That's a takedown from Savannah. Yes, a proper takedown. Leon trying, trying to roll her over. Definitely. She's trying to keep her in check because if she lets go, Savannah could take her back. Yes, just like that. If she can just get her hooks in, she'll have a better chance. This is a bad Whoa. position this is for Lillian. Good, good, good. Savannah has got a mount. She is in a mount position. She's Those hits to the ribs will hurt somehow. They will take their toll definitely after a while. Now she's in the mount position. That's what she was trying to do. Savannah trying to release herself to get space for some punches to the face of Lillian. Savannah is definitely landing a few Lillian of those. Looks like she's going for some sort of submission. She's going for a submission. Savannah is not here to mess around. But now Lillian. Oh, this is not good for Savannah. No, very, She's very straight up against the cage, has Lillian in closed guard, but that means Lillian can go for a ground and pound if she wanted to. No, no but the guard is way too, too, too locked. The it is, is locked, but, but arms, I feel like if Lillian. she keeps the arms down there, it, it no, can't be so yeah. bad for her. And that's exactly what it is. Lillian is, is trying to get her arms free and start pounding, but, but I think Savannah did quite well. Savannah did quite well to keep those arms down. If Lillian creates some distance between her and Savannah, Savannah will be in a terrible position. I actually feel like Savannah is in a good position to roll her over. Lillian definitely trying to get control in this situation. Savannah is holding on quite, quite well, getting hold of, of Lillian's arm, trying to prevent that damage, trying to prevent those punches. If she could do a sweep, it would be better for her in this at this point. Uh -huh. Lillian trying to release herself. Savannah is saying, no, uh, well, she does land a few hits in, to the face of Savannah. Those are so many hits to the face of Savannah. Free. Savannah, is Savannah needs to, to keep her there. close. She needs to keep her very close. She's losing her arms. She's losing she her upper body. Closer. She needs to get her close. Bounce, grab her by the neck and pull her close. Yeah. Olivia. Again, she has taken so many hits to her face. Very many hits, but she's just about hanging in there. And she's not, also not using her leg frame as well, because it could help her. She needs to let go of that guard and get into a better situation. Push Lillian off and get well, back onto her face. Exactly just like that. Just, just like, like that. But uh, Lillian says you're not going nowhere. Lillian she's got saying inside not. control. This Savannah is struggling. I feel like Savannah is exposing her face way too much. She has been taking quite a number of hits. She's using not so hard, action. but they yep. will count. Yeah, but she's using her, her hands to keep Lillian at bay. Yeah, she's been doing that the whole time she's been down on her back. What an intense first round this has been. Lillian certainly well, looks like the more powerful Lillian is fighter. going for the mount. She is going for the mount. Yes, she got uh, it. Uh, she has the mount. She's like, wow. oh, she's this, is, this is very, very dangerous for Savannah. Savannah... Savannah trying desperately to keep Lillian close to her now. She's trying for the reversal, but there's oh, no nice. space for Ooh. that either. Right. She needs to keep Lillian close. Try and keep her very oh, that, oh those, these are landing. These are now. way too many hits to her face. Yeah. And the clock is not helping her. Not at all. A minute is way too much if you're in that position, Olivia. In a corner, they're trying to tell her to. She, need, she needs to close that distance. She needs to close that distance. She needs to hold her hands the way she was holding the hands earlier on. She's not doing it as well anymore. Take her back Push down. Push her back. Instruction from the coach. Exactly Lillian is playing by her coach's instructions, and it seems to be working for her. Oh, oh nice reversal. reversal there. What a reversal. That's what, that's what Olivia was saying she should do, and that's exactly what she did eventually. She will take a few minutes to rest there. 
Leon is now going to be on the on the receiving end as soon as Savannah can get out of that hold. No, but Lillian is doing well to keep her close, and this is exactly what Savannah perhaps failed to do. I think Savannah did it for the earlier part of this, for the earlier part of the fight, but uh, but after after a while, she didn't really have that guard in place. Didn't really have control of her opponent's arms, Leon's and she took to several that. hits. Stop. Uh, Saved by the bell. Saved by the bell, by the bell indeed. Wow, what a what great a round, test that, round that has been. Very, very intense. Ladies got both got off their blocks so fast. I think these two have shown so much heart, so much fight. My only disquiet is how 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 well they will be able to regulate their breathing because we've seen fighters before who have come up, Such come out up aggressive. aggressive. By the third round or second round, you you know there's no more gas in your tank and you're you're gassed out. But let's see how the two ladies will do this. It seems they came with the same game plan. Both wanted to finish it off early. No, I, I, I like the way Savannah started this fight. She was she was quite aggressive. She got the early takedown, but once once Lillian got the reversal and then got into the mount position, Lillian definitely took over in terms of uh, in terms of being on top, landing more hits, more more strikes, more punches. And at one point, it looked like she she couldn't even finish that fight in the first round. But Savannah did well to hang in there and eventually have a late reversal and. When they to finish. go to the ground, it seems like they both know how to survive. Yeah, and, and of course we have to remind people these are two fighters with a kickboxing background. Yeah, uh, Savannah is more Muay Thai. Lillian is more of a of a Taekwondo, Taekwondo. fighter. But on the ground, they showed that uh, they've definitely been working quite but, a bit. But I feel like uh, Savannah looks to be more dangerous on the ground. If she gets an opportunity, she can get you to submit. Well, I uh, well, I think she, she attempted for one brief moment. Yes, she did. She, she, she looked like she was going for one submission, but but Lillian, Lillian definitely has, I think, the power advantage. And, and you could tell in certain positions, Let's she just was in say we've got two good fighters in that cage. Fighter, but are you ready? I Fighter, don't know how you would score that first Fighter. one, but uh, it was close. And it does. Very, very close. And there we go. Wow, a powerful knee to the rear. Right there. Aggressive from the start again. Okay, like we said. Remember, knees are allowed when you're up, no knees when you're on the ground, especially to the face of your opponent. No elbows as well. Savannah, is, Savannah, Savannah, I think, should be going for a few more knees. After all, she is a Muay Thai fighter, you'd expect that. That double under who could be to the advantage of Lillian. It is. Savannah has got to run out of it as fast as she can. Savannah attempted to take her down. Now she's got the double underhook. Is it just me or is Savannah a bit tired? They, they've slowed down. Uh, I think she, the pace... She has to be. That, that first round was too intense. Oh, she, the pace has slowed down. She has oh, got she her has back. Got she has got her back. She's for a rear naked choke. She is looking for that rear naked oh, choke. She has got her back. In. This is dangerous for Lillian. This is what you're talking about, Olivia. She needs to get the second hook in. Other, she needs to get that hook in. Lillian is doing well, just about to survive, but she's getting it. As long as that second hook isn't in, Lillian can get out of this. This is, this is the, she still she has let, her she back. Let's go. How? Again. again nice. she has it. Lillian exposes her this is it. again. This is dangerous. Very, very dangerous, ah. but she... The choke wasn't in time. The choke was not in. That was close for That was Savannah. an easy escape for Lillian. Savannah looks tired. Not that yes, easy, she does. But so tired. Things have reversed now. She's taking the hits. Now, now. She's doing good to keep her what? far away at first, but now close. You know, but that's it. I think, I think when Savannah gets into this position, she needs to keep on pulling, pulling the opponent again. close to her, avoiding all these hits. How should be getting her by the, by the neck? Trying her very, very best, but like I said, there's she definitely. She needs a reversal to get out of this situation. Three minutes to go. That's what she's trying to do. She managed to do that late in the first round. Savannah is clearly running out of gas. Well, I oh, think and Lillian is taking between her is. advantage. Oh, these oh, are going these straight are to the face. Hits the face of Savannah. Straight to the Way face. How many. much longer is this going to last? Responding. She is, is watching. She definitely is still responding, but she is she's taking a lot of punishment here. She looks so knackered, guys. She needs Lil to keep going if Lillian she wants to win this. getting into a mount position, but Savannah is desperately trying to hold on and probably go for that reversal. Gets her neck. Trying her very best. This is this is a tough one. This is a very very tough one. These two fighters are giving everything they have. I think Savannah did well to get out of that situation. She so was in well. trouble yet again. Consider. Considering how tired she looks. She looks very, very tired. But I think perhaps that is just how that 
might be her style. Uh, no, you, uh, you look tired. You take hits and look. No, I mean, tired. I mean, she looks. She <laughs> looks like she's not there, but she is. That's what I mean. That. Uh, give it up to her. She's got. A she's, proper got a, she's got a lot of heart, but but I still think Lillian has the power advantage. I think yeah. that's why when Lillian has been on top, she looks like she's yeah. she's she's causing a lot more damage than the other way around. I actually feel like the reason Savannah did not get proper advantage of that naked rear choke is because she doesn't have so so much power in her reach. Yeah, I, I think it was definitely yeah, a factor. In her arms. It was definitely a factor because she she had the back, she had the opportunity, but right now she's managed to turn this around. Well, like it's a game of both technique and power. Clearly, Savannah has got a bit of technique, enough technique. Ian, but you're does she have definitely enough power? right. Because when Lillian was in the top position, she kept punching Savannah, trying to get her to no get knocked out or something. No, no doubt about but it. She was Savannah, trying to finish. in the very same position, is just. I think she's still the one taking the hits. No, <laughs> yeah, she's, 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 yeah. she's, she's definitely taking a few more hits, and yeah. I think I think again that's just the natural power disadvantage that she has. But she has. Oof. Oh, Ooh. this is this dangerous. A triangle. This is so. Oh, oh this is really. She is not going she down. She is not going down easy. Lillian was definitely trying to go for the triangle right there. Savannah gives her a test of her own does. Whoa, whoa, whoa! That was interesting. Nice exchange. Okay, Savannah is on top. <laughs> and Savannah a minute is to now go. On top. This is this is. This she is. needs to use this position. She does. She needs to take advantage if and try to win this round. I think they would both use the clock, right now. I think this is they a very close round. We're very very close round, and I think the last 25 seconds could decide who wins this particular one. Well, I feel like Savannah took way too many earlier. She took she took a few hits, but but uh, but she had opportunities. She she. She, she had the early takedown. She tried to go for the rear naked choke. So she had her opportunities. But yeah, like you said, uh, she took a lot of punishment when, uh, when Lillian was, was in the position. And she has been saved by the bell. I what? Think I think they both look exhausted, but Around. fair play to these two fighters. It's good to see the amount of heart, the amount of effort they're showing, and the amount of skill on show. So much skill, so much heart, so much resilience, especially from Savannah. There's definitely a lot of Brazilians. There were moments I thought in the first round and in the second round that that might not actually go the distance. Go the distance I, I, sure. I, thought, yes. I thought they might stop it at some point in the first round and then again but look in the second at that. round. But Savannah had a proper opportunity to finish this off, but she clearly did. she had no power in her arms. So All legs. The, I think the problem <laughs> and is legs that as well. I think the problem is that for like the rear naked shock, she had it, but it wasn't set up it right. It wasn't. Mm. So Lillian could easily get yeah, out of it. it. Even it's the same thing happened for the Amber. She almost had it, but it wasn't right. I think she's got the idea of what she wants to do and how she wants to win her fights. But execution, but execution she's having is issues with that. Yeah, of course, uh, we need to remind Look people at that. again. Look at that opportunity. Yeah. That, was, that was, that was, that was. For one second, I actually thought she had it. I thought she had it because she got the opponent's back. She attempted to go for the choke, not once, not twice. She eventually looked like she might have it, but. Well, well, her look. face says it all. She took way too many hits in her face. It's Especially when time. Lillian was on top of her. But the first two rounds, guys, uh, do, would you give it to Lillian? The first two rounds? Tough one to call, I think. I think. It's still tight? It's, it's very tight, but I think Lillian just about. A slight edge. I think Lillian just about. Because right now, Savannah is tired. She, she is completely exhausted. tired. And Lillian is standing, like, she's ready to go for the next round. Fight. Well, I'm told one of the techniques of this sport is to pretend like you're so tired, confuse your opponent, <laughs> they try to come at you and finish it off, and bang, you get them, beat them at their own game. Is that what Savannah is trying to do? Only one way to find out. For sure. Took a powerful hit to her ribs. But she's so tired, guys. She's, yeah, she's, she's, really so tired. Tired. she's definitely she looks tired. Like she's, she's not using... <laughs> that technique. No oh, technique at all. She's exhausted. She's holding she's on to the. Really she's holding onto the cage at this moment in time. I think if Lia, if Lillian could sense the fatigue, there's no doubt she she would go for the kill right here. How do you finish off a, a, a fatigued opponent? Oof, that Lillian. landed yet again. <laughs> punch them until. Uh, uh, punch, punch them into submission. Lillian. They are telling her to use her knees. In, in this, pos not, in this position, yes, you need to try to even stamp on your opponent. Just stamp on your opponent, get them off balance, create an opportunity for yourself. 
I'm actually surprised Lillian is not a cat, taking advantage sure of this. I, I think she's being nice. <laughs> she can easily take Savannah down to the ground, get on top. There is no being nice in the cage where... <laughs> I think fair play to uh, fair play to Savannah when she's looked like she's been in trouble. She's I think she somehow gets She has. She's she's really given everything she has. So but I think it does look like she's moving in slow motion. No, she has definitely slowed down from the first round. There's no question about it. She's holding on. But yes, keep on telling her to use her knees. The trainer is telling her use your knees, use your knees. I she has opportunities to do so. I don't think she has the power to get any of her legs off the ground. I'm 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 I'll be honest with you. I expected a few. Fight more and defend yourself. So many uh, the referee is beginning to get enough of it. I think she's telling her to defend herself. She's not no, well, she's ten she, seconds she, without she, a response. We know, it's a taken corner no, no, She got she definitely got her guard up right there where she got her guard up. Lillian came into shots. this third round looking a bit more Oh again. Like she, she had taken more, way too many more punches, energy, but at this point you see both of them, they are both Cut. just wow. staying no, she's in. It's a up, wrap, it's a wrap. The referee has had enough. The ref had enough. Lillian Lillian Akello uh, has Akello. won her first fight in the mixed martial arts. What a fight this has been. She is called the Cobra, and the Cobra did not fear the rain, did not get the afraid rain did to not take come any pouring. But the rain did not make it easy. Not, not yeah. at all. Not at all. The rain did not it was never it going to be easy, but give it up to Lillian. She kept going. No, no, no doubt about Even that. Even when Savannah came up with a few ideas, no, yeah, so Savannah definitely put in a lot of effort. She she showed that she has a lot of fight within her. But uh, but yeah, eventually I think uh, I think Lillian definitely had the power advantage. I think she and she had seemingly she she was the fitter one, the cardio advantage as well. So she managed to to outlast Savannah and to outpower Savannah. Savannah yeah. got some opportunities to submit her opponent. But right. she just didn't quite lock them in. Yeah, I, I feel like if uh, if I were Savannah's coach, my biggest focus would be on her strength. Her strength and her cardio. Her cardio. Her cardio. This, is, this is go to the gym, go to the gym, go to the gym. Lillian did pretty well. Yeah, she no, she did. She, I think I think Lillian did well early on. Savannah started quite quite aggressive. But Lillian did well to get out of that position. They both started aggressively, but at the end, you could see they were both tired. But Savannah, at the start of the third round, uh, she, she, could yeah, she could barely win. I, I think her biggest un undoing was taking way too many hits in the face. Well, well she did, but yeah. Uh, yeah. Way <laughs> I was too going many to, hits. I, I, was going, I was going to say there was, there was definitely a cardio thing, but I cannot downplay <laughs> those, those the, the strikes that she was getting to her face. But but fair play to both fighters. I think I think we've seen a lot of heart. We've seen a lot of effort. Uh, could we put that down to experience? Uh, yes, I think that also played a slight factor. But the thing about the thing about Savannah today, she showed a lot more about what she can, she can do. do. Uh, she's a good fighter. She's potentially a very good fighter. But but she's she's still very very young. Like yeah. like we said before, she had one Muay Thai fight, one kickboxing fight coming into this. So this will definitely help her moving forward. But no question. Work on that cardio, work on that yeah. power, and even with the submissions, you could see some signs of what she was trying to do. Yeah. But I think I, I think a lot more work on that, and yeah. she has the potential to be a very good fighter. Well, be sure I will be see her, be seeing her again in this uh, hexagon probably. Good to see Lillian there. Lillian looks like she can go an extra two or three more uh, three rounds. No, yeah, but just but one. So, just one. I, I think I think she I think Lillian also slowed down, but I think Savannah slowed down a lot more, and that's why eventually that was the situation. Well, let's head straight to our ring announcer to hear what has come out of this. Ladies and gentlemen, and now in the ladies' featherweight. Are the one son MMA winner by technical knockout, Lillian Akello, the Cobra!